And here we have all of the parts of the Rassen Assault Frigate. From a core bundle that I have on eBay. It's everything that you need to put the ship together. Uh, we'll go through each of the levels and some tips on how to assemble it and what to do. Uh, the top level is printed here in a single piece. Um, it includes a helm that is a helm piece along with a separate piece that is the captain's wheel. Uh, these are put together using bits of 3D printer filament. Uh, I always include a couple yards of that in with each ship that I send out. Uh, you just cut off a piece that goes right there in the hole and that'll create some alignment pins. And as you can see, there is a corresponding set of, of holes there and you just super glue them together. Uh, that is also the way that you put together each of the parts of the levels. There's just more sets of those uh, and that will make sure each of your levels are aligned so you don't end up with a wonky set of uh, pieces put together. And uh, between the levels, you are, they are set up for uh, five millimeter by two millimeter magnets that are uh, phenomenal at putting them together. My personal one of this ship uses that and uh, they are phenomenal for holding it together. Uh, if you don't want to use magnets uh, for some reason, you, uh, I can include some alignment pins that will go in that. Um, it won't be enough for each of the bits, but it will be enough to align all of the levels. Um, it, it doesn't make sense to put them in each and every one. It makes it very difficult to align. Um, but yeah, I, I would strongly suggest the magnets. You can find them on eBay or Amazon for, for a pretty inexpensive price. This is the second level. Uh, it includes a interior section here with some interior walls and I include enough doors for all of the working doors to work and I give you a couple extra so you can have some options. Uh, I include a little kind of iron jail door um, so you can set up a brig somewhere along with a uh, what looks like kind of like a waterproof hatch for an internal thing, so you can kind of have a waterproof room where you put valuable cargo or something. Um, and then there's also some external hatches that those get, those get rounded hatches, like this guy right there. Uh, and all the doors work, so you can slide them in and they're interchangeable. Uh, I wouldn't glue them in, I would just use them on an as-needed basis. This is the bottom level. Uh, it is a total of six pieces plus the walls. The walls are all one piece. Uh, and then they slot right in. You can see right where they slot in there. Uh, more doors and all of that stuff. And we have the base and the keel. Uh, the base is two pieces that you'll just glue together along with this guy. This guy will get glued down into the, into the slot there. And then this stem locks on just, just a rotating, simple rotating lock along with the actual mounting point. It does the same thing on the top of that stem. And then this guy fits right here into the hole on the keel. Um, it will press fit and hold in reasonably well, but uh, I went ahead and glued mine on just for safety's sake in case it gets bumped or whatever. The uh, ship does get kind of cantilevered out over the front of everything. So I thought that was safest. Um, the keel here is two parts that you'll glue together along with these little caps that go over these modular mounting points. There are a handful of those modular points on the ship, uh, mostly on this level, but there, like I said, there's also some here on the keel. Um, I do include enough caps for all of those modular points, uh, including some extras for options for this odd man out on the back. Uh, I do sell a separate uh, extras add-on pack for the frigate that includes, uh, for example, a elemental ring and some engines and uh, sails and things like that. Uh, it is also available on my web store on, on eBay, and uh, that's everything there. And the only other two little bits that we have are a hatch and a 
staircase for the hatch over here on level two. Uh, the hatch just goes right on top and the staircase goes right underneath it. So you have so, uh, you know, a way to get between the two levels. Uh, that's everything. If you have any questions, uh, you can always reach out to me either here on YouTube or on eBay. And yeah, that's that.